Volvo is known for being at the forefront of safety in automotive. They invented a three-point seat belt, and it was just in the news that they are doing iterative improvement on that seat belt design using software. So what they're doing basically is adding more intelligence inside of the seatbelt controller so that the seatbelt can basically react differently depending on the severity of the crash and the weight and body shape of the person who's sitting in the seat. I think this once again shows the power of software and how a little bit of intelligence everywhere can make products so much better. Here, we're making cars safer by adding intelligence to seat belts. And you might think a seat belt is a very simple system. Does it really need software? And I think Volvo is clearly demonstrating that there are huge safety benefits to adding intelligence to these systems. Volvo is also adding OTA updates to their seat belts because now that you have a complex piece of software that behaves based on modeling of the user's behavior, modeling of the crash, they're going to want to iteratively improve it, ship updates to this software so that it can get better and better as they get more data from, from the real world. But once millions of vehicles have those smart seat belts, they'll be collecting data and pushing updates to make sure it works as well as it can. This is the power of software, the ability to iterate. I think it's very exciting.